Yeah, they really found some surprising, threatening things, Christine. But first of all, this is one pursuit that stops dead in its tracks just like that, all because, as you say, OnStar high-tech security system that one longtime now-retired LAPD sergeant says actually puts the odds in favor of law enforcement when it comes to these wild, crazy pursuits. Look here. The end of a high-speed pursuit. This stolen Chevy Corvette stopped cold right in its tracks, not by a pit maneuver or spike strips, but by the onboard safety and security tracking system called OnStar. OnStar contacted CHP dispatch to notify us of a stolen vehicle, which was on the 405 near Roscoe Boulevard. After a short pursuit, about three minutes, the vehicle was disabled by OnStar. It's the latest high-tech crime-fighting weapon that, in a pursuit, puts the odds in the favor of law enforcement. These things happen in a, in a second. They either go really good or they can go bad. So uh, having OnStar or a feature like that, that technology is always a plus. Chris Izagari retired now from LAPD after more than 30 years and dozens of pursuits. He knows how pursuing officers can actually communicate with OnStar, even making sure where the target of the pursuit, like this Corvette, is stopped, wanting it to be stopped in a safe area where no one else is put at risk. He can uh, communicate with OnStar and the uh, the other officers say let's wait another half a block and uh, maybe they're passing in an area where it's a uh, there's a low population and it's an open field or something like that. OnStar confirms it works with law enforcement to as it says catch a thief saying quote an OnStar advisor can send a signal to disable a stolen vehicle's engine and gradually slow the vehicle to an idle speed to assist police in attempting to recover a member's vehicle once authorities have confirmed conditions are appropriate and safe. We can also ensure that car is not going to get started again. Isn't that nice that we can make sure a bad guy doesn't get a second chance at trying to hurt somebody out there? And there is no second chance for this bad guy pulled from the Corvette where CHP finds narcotics and something even more threatening. Boxes loaded with several high-powered assault weapons. There was uh, AK-47s involved, and there was handguns, and there was uh, uh, 1911s. There was quite a uh, mixture of guns. There was uh, magazines with an extended drum magazine, and uh, they're very dangerous weapons. And now live, I want to hear something else that the police know about OnStar and how they use it. If there's a report of a stolen vehicle, police think they spot that vehicle. They can actually have OnStar flash the taillights a couple of times on that vehicle to confirm it's the one they're looking for. And the taillights would flash even without the driver who's trying to get away. He has no ID, and the lights are actually flashing, giving him away to police. No wonder that retired sergeant says this is really something that finally puts the odds where they belong with the good guys. For now, we're live here at Van Nuys, Atlasco. Back to both of you.